Just a quick warning, ladies and gentlemen, if you are not old enough to watch this, and I'm afraid you're going to have to click away because this series will include very strong violence, very strong language, and scenes of a very inappropriate nature. So if you're not allowed to watch things like this, then I'm afraid you're going to have to click away. I apologise. Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Grand Theft Auto 5, part number two. We're here. Oh. Yes, it's a new day. I'm excited to continue this on. This you're game what? What? You don't runs like amazingly. You think that I am an Arab. What? No. What are you talking about? Excuse like me. That, wait. that oh, wait, boy. I, I... I am his mentor. I am so proud of you. What do you mean, a mentor? Don't worry about that. Okay, so what you got for him? James DeSanta. Some kid. He is already late on his payments, and I have this bad feeling that he will do more damage to the car than we can get back from him in the exorbitant interest rate payments. Huh? Just go and get it. The house is on um, uh, Hampstead, uh, off Eclipse. It's an SUV. Huh? Some Rockford Hills daddy's boy nonsense. Don't worry about it. Try to bring the car back in good condition, huh? Gotcha. Don't worry about it. It's so good to see you, my boy. Hey, good luck in uh, law school, huh? So, As you can see, I've Mr. got a beard and a funky haircut because I did just go to the hairdressers. I tried to get to change of clothes because I hate this outfit that Franklin has. But, um... Yeah, no. Uh, you physically can't go in there because the game's not allowed you to yet. That's typical Rockstar fashion. I'm currently also watching Atletico Madrid versus Man United, so... If I get distracted at any point, that'll be why. I'm praying for an Atletico Madrid win. Hello, see you. Hey, did you change your mind? When I discover that you betray me, perhaps. I hear you took the bike for yourself, my employee of the month. Listen, man, me and Lamar was gonna get that back to you, dawg. Oh, I am sure. You will get this car off the daddy's boy, and then we talk. Insurance papers say they have a locked garage, so you'll need to gain access from inside the house. Man, it's never easy with you, is it, Simi? Do not talk to me about easy, you see. It's amazing how quick things can change. This game's going so much quicker already than I thought it was. We're already about to meet Michael. Hey, oh, still a lot to go. There go. They'll never know. I have to physically jump. Boom. Right around the back here. There's the car. Ba boom boom. That's just because you have a massive gaper, bitch. to knife attack me? No one creeps on the J-Dog, my niggas. Ooh, slaughter time. Oh, dear. Such casual use of the N-word. I don't like that. Dead, you fucking idiot. Oh, my God. Seriously? My brother is such a homo. Thank you, coach. Oh, dear. You're a real pro, Mrs. DeSanta. A real pro. Well, you're a great student. Now just loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? Yeah, loosen them up. There you go. And follow through. Perfect. Uh oh, okay. Oh. Jump you! Let's go, go, go. A lot of these missions will probably get done quite quick. <laughs> I know this game very well. I 
Simeon, I got the ride, man. I'm coming back. Yeah, if you actually bring the repossession to me this time, I can have it back out on the street before the day is done. That's a 9mm semi-automatic pushed against your skull. Uh, look around. You just keep driving where you're going. Hey, come on, man. This was a repo job. The guy was behind on his fucking note. Unlikely, considering my son just got the car. And looking at the way you're going about this, my guess, you're working a credit fraud. Credit fraud? Be serious, dude. I just worked the fucking repo. I appreciate a kid who follows orders without taking responsibility. Yeah, maybe one day we'll have a beer, and I'll explain how the world really works. Who gives you the slip? A car dealer, dawg, by the name of Simeon Terry. So this businessman, he look legit to you? Look, man, it's just between him and your fucking son. Don't worry. Me and Mr. Yeteri, we'll work this out. That the place? Yeah, this the place, man. Whoa. Drive into it. Right through the fucking window. And fast. Or I'll put two rounds in the back of your skull and do it myself. Man, you can't be for real. I look like a fucking joke to you. Man, fuck my life, man. Fuck it. Do it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's kill this woman as well. Oh, oh dear. I put her right through the window. <laughs> Franklin, what the fuck are you doing? Mr. Samuel, it's not exactly how it looks. I always trump big for a job well done. Now get out of here, kid. You motherfucker! Oh I yeah. Be treated like this. You think you could take me for a ride? Piece of cake. Look at this. You recognize this car? Huh? Does it look like it's worth five grand a month to you? You fucking racist! <laughs> he just calls everyone a racist. <laughs> Tell you something, this thing's gonna need some serious body work or it's worth five grand a month. <laughs> he agreed to financing, I have his signature. Yeah, did he agree to have some punk break into my fucking house? I, I thought so. I, uh... That kid might be a fucking idiot, but you are a fraudulent scumbag piece of shit. Oh. Don't make me have to come back here. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. That's mission of the day. Come. Love to see it. Now we can continue. Oh yeah. I'm taking my car back as well. Let's have a look at that. Look at look at the menu runs so nicely. Oh. It's a loud car. Beep beep. You got lucky, buddy. Now, this next part of the mission. Oh. Next part of the mission may cut a little bit because there is copyrighted music. Live in the dream, Michael. I might just cut the audio out here. Yeah. Uh, Aggie Man Collects is the best YouTuber in the planet. That's right, in, not on. He's inside the planet, because he is the planet. You lot are living in his world. <laughs> Morning. What do you want? Man, I come by for that drink you offer, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. 
Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession, okay? You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look, I'm retired. Ain't you a big young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years. And I got out alive. That makes me the right age. <clears throat> you look like a good kid. But if you want my advice, give the shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately, and maybe, just maybe if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. Go to college. Then you can rip people off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. Hmm. So what I saw the other day was like, when a corpse briefly reanimates itself and terrorizes everyone, right? What you saw the other day was a guy dealing with pests. I guess I never saw myself as just a fucking pest. Well, and today's lesson's all about humility. Tomorrow we'll try a training montage. A training what? Nothing. I was just lost in an 80s movie fantasy. <laughs> yeah, I can see you spend a lot of time there. Yeah, as much as I can. So that's why you're here in Vinewood then, right? Maybe I'm here because I'm just an idiot who thinks that imported palm trees are a good substitute for not really knowing what the fuck you're doing on this earth. Jesus, man. You a good time, you know that. I tell you what. <sighs> Least I can do is buy you that beer. There's a little bar I like. <sighs> it's not too far from here. Let's go. All right, man. I'm following you. Ah. <sighs> Let's take Amanda's car. Hey, Jim. I'm going for a drink. Dad, with... shit. I mean, our boat going down the Western Highway. It's... it's been stolen. What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane. All right, I'm coming for my boat. All righty then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. When you get I do what I can to help. Turn. That man. Lesson number one. Don't ever have kids. Hey man, look. If I had kids, I don't think no parenting issues would arise over who had both privileges and who don't. Shit, motherfuckers would be lucky to sit in a bathtub. Shit, things that desperate, huh? Nah, but you know, shit. I was making a point. Apologizing, self-deprecation. I know it well. Yeah, man, but shit, where the boat at? Little shit's been hijacked. They're somewhere on the Western Highway. Man, ain't you worried? About my boat? Yeah, I am. But you can always buy another boat. Yeah, tell my accountant that. Man, you can always get credit for one. But have you come repo it? No, yeah. thank you. <laughs> All right, homie. I ain't your home. I'm someone you want to impress. Real? Man, I thought you was retired. Why the fuck do I want to impress some slipper wearing motherfucker? He's got a point to be fair. Oh! There! There! There it is! That's my boat! Your boat's in a fucking hurry, man! Yeah, well, we'll catch him! Hey, what we about to do? I'm gonna get you close! And you're gonna go board that thing! Alright, man, shit! Fucking let's go! Alright, I got a piece in the glove box. They give you shit, I'll take it out. All oh, that's cool, man! Damn it. I was about to say how easy it is to steer in this with this high frame rate now. Yeah, all right. I'm guessing I wasn't supposed hey, to shoot him yet. It's 
to be fair, I shot him about three times. Turn early on. Don't you die on me yet. Ah, I fucking fall. Hey, it's just a thing. At least you still got a son. Hey, there's a chop shop back there, dog. We drive us there, we can get the ride fit. It's just a thing. I fall. Please stop doing that. Listen, I fucked up, okay? I'm not going to lie. That was a real. stays in his room all day and I don't have any other people to go with, you know? I like looking at it. Hey, this the place up here. I know this dude, man. His name How. He gonna look after me. So you sure you're good? Yeah, I got this. Right. Ooh, uh, I'm gonna come up front. Get out and walk around. It's okay, I can just climb over. Look, man, I'm gonna get the ride fixed, man. They dropped it back off at your house along with this dude. It's all good, though, man. You gonna get your head right, all right? All right. Listen, thanks for today. I appreciate it. You stop back out to the house, we'll talk. Ugh, you see? Show, sure, man. Hey, sorry we didn't get your boat, man. Yeah. Come on, man. Let's trick this whip, homie. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not gonna lie, I'm flying for these missions. Morning, Chirico. Deal, man. Huh? You and my old man? I see you at the dealership. 
Then someone steals my whip, and Pop is all like, he's been down there to talk to you guys. Yo, Pops did more than talk. What'd he do? Look, man, if he ain't tell you, I ain't gonna tell you. But I lost my fucking job, and I thought maybe he could help me find a new one. Dude, my dad is retired. Like, fully? Like, his only marketable skills are watching TV and daytime drinking. Man, look, I don't know, homie. He seems okay to me. Shit, he saved your ass. You saved my ass. Nah, nah, man. Well, well, maybe we good together, you know? Like, maybe we can get shit done we couldn't do separate. If it keeps him out of the house, that's cool by me. Yeah, well, we'll see. Look, I'm sorry my dad lost to your job. It's hard out there. Huh. I mean, oh, I'm man, I'm sorry, the at the moment. Oh, you got fired, dude. Damn, that's rough. Not fired as such. I didn't get a job. I've been there, homie. You've been putting them resumes out there, but no one's hiring, huh? No, I, uh, I didn't get a job. I've never had a job. It feels like hard work. Life, the days just kind of disappear. Hey, you play right to slaughter? Nah, not since the first couple. Yo, so like, since we're both unemployed, like, we could run together, you know? Yeah, I think about it, homie. Or, or we could just like, shop it, you know? Play darts or get our drink on? Strip clubs? Come on, dude, I get real crazy. Yeah, I got your number, shit, I need it, man, but, uh, hey, hey you know what? Man, go easy on your pops, dog. all right? All right, church. <laughs> exactly, man. My brother from another mother. I mean... I hope so, because my mom was kind of a skank back in the day. See ya. Yeah, whatever, homie. Peace. I'll just take Michael's car. Here's what it is. Well, that was easy enough. And alas, we continue. Mind, we'll turn back around. Oh, Atletico Madrid have just scored. <laughs> hey, Man United in the mud. Hey, look, man. Look, you were like a son to me. Employee of the month. Does that mean nothing to you? Man, the dude had a gun in my head. No loyalty, no integrity. You should have taken the bullet. Oh, my business, mission. my totally legitimate business. You're f Yeah. Oh, fuck. This has got to stop happening to me. Oh, I was supposed to change to Michael. Hey, you! Stop it! What's up, man? Get out of my way. Michael, calm down. What the fuck is going on? Nothing happened. It was a misunderstanding. She fucked the frick in my bed. <laughs> you bullshitting me. It wasn't like that. You in? Fuck it. I'm in. Let's roll. Let's get this motherfucker. Just don't kill him! <laughs> you okay, homie? What happened? The guy bounced my wife is what happened. Which guy? The guy I'm paying to teach her tennis. Tennis coach? Oh, that's fucked up, man. Who is dude, homie? You know, back in the hood, man, we gotta watch out for the hell, man, dog. Yeah, I'm a cuckold, a snob, and a fucking good shit. Off to the left, right there. Thank you for taking up the whole road. Appreciate you, mate. Oh well, Lottie man. just scored for Atletico Madrid, so I'm happy. Man United, mudded. The fuck is he doing? What is going on here? Move! Fuck, man, I think he lost his leg. He lives somewhere up in the canyon. We'll find him. Oh yeah, that's supposed to be part of the mission. Ah, the fuck is he? What's this track here? Hey, you want to be fucking out? Yeah, hey, keep your eye out. Little freaks up there, look. Oh, shit, Cole's doing all right for himself. Hey, asshole! You ran off before we could settle our debts! Mine's so fine! You got the wrong idea, man! There's a winch in the back of the truck. Tied a cable to one of those supports up there. You finna pull his deck down? Hey, that prick pulled my marriage down. Man, you really gonna be this fucking dramatic? Yeah, whatever. I 
I told you I comped the session, bud. Well, there were a lot of freaking sessions, bud. I'm thinking you were working on more than just her backhand. Mandy's backhand has come a long way, bro. But sometimes it's got to get worse to get better. Yeah, well, maybe I should come up there and practice my backhand. On your face! Oh, bud, your negative energy is seriously bringing me down. Oh, I hope it is, bud. We hooked up, man. You come into my house, take my money, and nail my wife? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm gonna stick up my hand and say that was uncool, bud. My bad. Seriously. Oh, how fucking magnanimous. May I please offer you my applause? You fucking motherfucker! Dude! And we'll see how you like it when someone fucks with your shit! Well, hey! Wait! You got the wrong idea, pal! Whoa! Fuck! Here we go! <laughs> Let's see what happens! Oh, you are probably crazy! <laughs> oh, shit! Sorry, man, I'm sweating already! Oh, hell yeah, homie! You know what time it is! Actually, all it takes is a little pickup truck to destroy the entire house. Franklin's aim was better than yours. Don't get defensive. Go to a shooting range. Work on your aim. You'll do fine. Oh, fuck, man. Shit, you good? Fine as wine. Got a few knocks. You okay? You did good. Say, bro, bro. I'm cool, man. I mean, you. Mentally. Mentally. Oh, man. I'm fucking excellent. My heart ain't pumped like that in years. It's half time. Fucking aim, Bubba. Man, you sound kind of man. Just been greenlit by the Mexican underworld ambassador to Los Santos. Whew. Hey, thanks for the help out there today, kid. I had no idea it was gonna get that hot. Shit, pulling houses off the hillside sure has a weird way of fucking with people. Yeah, well, I thought I was through with all that shit. I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh shit, I think we're about to find out. You know who I am? Do you know who I am? Do you? No. Do you? You? I think so. Good. I know who you are. I know where you live. Who are you? I'm Franklin. License. No. Franklin. Maybe help Mr. DeSanta here. Who am I? I think Martin Madrazo. Good boy. Now, maybe give him a little of a background. Man, Mr. Madrazo... It, Mr. Madrazo is a legitimate businessman who was wrongfully accused of running a Mexican-American gang and a narcotic ring, but the charges were dropped because of the witnesses came up 
Miss Smart Cat. Now, Michael, got a question for you. What did you prove an architectural, significant, modernist, wonder home down the hillside in Vinewood Hills? I thought the owner was banging my wife. Well, that was a strange house for a tennis coach. <sighs> I wasn't thinking straight. Mm, clearly. Yeah. <sighs> well, Natalia will need a hotel while you finance the rebuilds, won't she? Sure. Good. And I'm guessing here that the rebuild uh, will be somewhere in the 2.5 million range. <laughs> of course. Great. That's nice. Come on, man. Damn, you all right? Never better. So what now? Looks like I'm gonna have to postpone my retirement. Fuck. Oh, man, I'm mortgaged up to my eyeballs. Look, I only know one way to make money. I'm gonna have to give an old friend a call. Lester. Oh, God, Lester. I think he's in town somewhere. I've heard that man's voice for the last ten years. He's the longest going character that I've heard. I go. We're actually going for this really quick. I've been playing this game for what a total of about an hour and five, Hello. ten minutes. Is this still the number for Lester Crest? Who's asking? Who's asking? Who's asking? You're awful cagey. <laughs> <clears throat> Even for a dead man. Michael. Ooh, you don't sound good, buddy. <laughs> Tactful and charming, even in death. Hey, come see me, old friend. I'm living in Los Santos, just like you. Marietta Heights. Whoa, whoa, wait. Hey, how do you... Hello? You fucker. I think, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to leave this part here now. We're making really good progress, because we're already about an hour in. That's always good. That's always, always good. Anywho, I will see you guys in the next one.